Installing the All Orders Trial Software. This tutorial will illustrate the processes of installing the All Orders Trial Software. Once you've registered on the Number Cruncher website, you will receive an email thanking you for trying the software. On this email, you will receive a customer ID and a trial ID. You will need your trial ID when you first run our products. There are several links included the software download link, how to contact us by logging a case with your questions, video tutorials on using all orders, our online user manual, knowledge base, which is our frequently asked questions, and this video tutorial to walk you through step by step. Before you install the software, please review the system requirements. The first link is the software download link. All Orders is comprised of two parts, the server and the client software. The server software contains the database that All Orders uses, namely the powerful Microsoft SQL Server Express 2005. The client software contains the All Orders program which retrieves, inserts, updates, and deletes records in the database. The client is installed on the computers that will use all orders and should also be installed on the server. Generally, the server software is installed on a dedicated computer. However, for the trial, you can install both the client and the server on the same computer. Once you purchase the software and you're ready to share it on the server, just install the server setup and transfer the data from the database on the computer to the server. Create a new shared folder called AO Data or any name you choose in the C drive. This is where your setup files will be located. Now we will install the server setup onto my computer. If you are logging into the server, log in as an administrative user. Click on Server Setup. The software is contained in this SQL Server file. Press Run and run again. When the dialog appears, press Setup. The SQL installer will now take over and complete the installation. After the installation is complete, you will see Microsoft SQL Server 2005 in your Windows programs. That's all you have to do for the server, but if you're technically inclined, you will note that the All Orders server installation created an SQL instance named All Orders. Now let's create the client setup. It is designated for 32-bit and 64-bit operating systems. If you have a 32-bit system, choose this client setup. And for the 64-bit, if you don't know which bit size your computer has, click on Start, right-click on Computer or My Computer, and Properties. Once you press Setup, a dialog appears for you to run and run again and set up. Then the installation will continue for a moment. Click Next on the next few screens to complete the installation. Your All Orders program is located in the C Drive, Program Files, Number Cruncher, and All Orders. Double click the All Orders icon and you will see the dialog box to create a new Number Cruncher data file. Creating an All Orders data file will not affect your QuickBooks company file. Please have your QuickBooks file open. If you have a multi-user version of QuickBooks, log in as the admin user. When you click Next, you will see a QuickBooks screen that will ask you to grant permission to All Orders by Number Cruncher. Select Yes whenever this QuickBooks company file is open. Next, select the server that was created in the server setup. Remember the typical name for the server instance is your computer name backslash all orders. Select the folder AO Data or the folder you created in the C drive where the new SQL server data file and the company file were installed, both with an NCD file extension. Here is a summary of your selection. Advanced users can modify the SQL server settings or click Next to continue. Enter the trial ID code given to you in the email. 
There you will see how many days you have before your trial expires. All Orders is now synchronizing with QuickBooks. Set your default general ledger accounts. Uncheck Synchronize on Startup and Finish. The lists in all orders and QuickBooks such as the items, customers, and vendors are now in sync. You are ready to use all orders by number cruncher.